Hey everyone, it's Mike from the Relating Revolution. Sorry if there's wind, but I couldn't resist being outside today uh, for good reason. <laughs> if you take a look around, it's pretty beautiful here. So uh, today is day 27 out of 30, and it's going to be a short and sweet one. And the prompt for today is what is something that your clients really crave for? And one of the things they really crave for is forgiveness. And forgiveness is uh, a little bit different. I have a little bit of a different view of forgiveness than, than other people might think about sometimes. Forgiveness is actually a gift we give to ourselves. And if you break down the word forgiveness, you have for and give. And so the give part is generosity. And the for part is the, uh, we're giving ourselves the ability to move forward in our life free from the influence of the past. So regardless of what others have done or did do or didn't do, if we are carrying around the hurts and the wounds of the past, we are, we are interpreting our present moment through the lens of that hurt and pain. And we are, we are continuing, like when, if, if shitty things happen to us, they sucked enough when they happen. And so if we keep hanging on to them and ruminating on them and feeling anger and bitterness and resentment and about them, then actually we're, continu we're, we're continuing to, that poison is continuing to fester and we're actually adding insult to injury. We're not just, uh, it didn't just suck the first time, but then it, every other time we think about it, we feel into it, we, what, we worry about it, we don't. And so forgiveness is actually a gift that we give to ourselves to be free from the past. And so it is a conscious choice. It is, it, 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 it makes complete sense neurologically and biologically it does not mean that we have to condone in fact at all if we give our if we are empowered if we are if, for, if we forgive and we let go of the past we actually become a more empowered being that is going to have uh, be able to set appropriate boundaries and refuse to be uh, tread upon in the same way again and all these things so it, it has nothing to do with it has nothing to do with um, it's not a weakness thing it's actually an empowered thing it's it's a it's a very it's a it's a it's a way for us to to move forward with our lives for, by choosing to no longer hold on to the pain and the regret of past wounds and oftentimes forgiving ourselves is is challenging if not more challenging than forgiving others and so that's another maybe another another video for another day but hopefully um, thinking about forgiveness and, and, and asking, asking you know, what, what needs to be let go of in your life? What is, what is still um, compelling you to think, feel, and act in certain ways? And how can we move through it? How can we let it go? How can we be generous to ourselves to give ourselves the space and the freedom to no longer be influenced by whatever it was? All right, y'all. Love you. Have a beautiful day. Enjoy the sunshine. If you got that in your parts, I'm going to go do the same. And uh, we'll see you soon. Drop me a hello. Feel free to write a question or send me a private message if that works for you.